Well, off we go. Should we really take this? something in the water. We've got lots to do. What are those things I sometimes see you chuck out in the middle of fights? What? You mean my bombs? Bombs? 
As in the things people use to clear out rocks? But I could have sworn I saw something other than fire burst from some of yours. That's because these aren't ordinary bombs. They're specially made ones filled with astral energy. Hmm, okay. And why do you shoot the bombs after you release them? It's a part of my strategy. The effects of my bombs change when I fire bullets of a different astral element at them. It makes it difficult for enemies to predict what effect they'll have, or when they'll go off. One moment you're using powerful bombs, the next you're using powerful healing arts. They're kinda on the opposite ends of the spectrum, aren't they? Think of it this way. If you ever get caught up in the blast of one of my bombs and you manage not to die, I'll be able to heal you using my arts. Hmm. I'll do my best to not die then. I've noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you and try to dodge our attacks at the last second. I hate those guys. I can get some hits in when they move in to attack, but otherwise they slip past damn near everything else I throw at them. If what you're seeking is a way to more reliably hit them, there is a solution. Try to outclass them on reflexes? I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some extent. They emerge as the land itself and take root on my command. They will swiftly bind the enemies, at which point you can dispatch them. Huh? Uh, what he means is that he can make plants grow to hold the enemies in place. At least I think that's probably what he's saying. I'm glad at least one of us understands him. So basically, if we find an enemy that likes to dodge, we should let Doholim handle it. I shall do what I can within my modest means to help. Hey, Shion, where does your gun come from? What do you mean, where does it come from? When you're fighting, it looks like it just appears out of nowhere. Oh, that's transferal technology. When I don't need my weapon, I submerge it in empty space. And when I do, I summon it. Make sense? Not really. But it sounds pretty amazing. Huh? Well, that way you don't have to carry around any heavy weapons or worry about enemies trying to steal them, right? It's a pretty cool invention. You realize you're praising the technology of your enemies, right? So? Technology is technology. It's not good or bad in and of itself. I guess that's true. Be a good place to fight. Wow, Kisara, it's so big. You're, you're talking about my shield, right? We got some good equipment. I can't say its appearance is to my tastes, personally. Come 
Um, Demon Tank! Oh, oh, this one oh, Are those rocks? Oh, oh, yeah. I'm all stopped up! He's dead! Come and hit him where it hurts most! No further! We're going on! Come and hit him! What is it? Flash! 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 Demon Tank! Illuminate the dark I'll finish you here and now! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! With your flames and my technique? We're stronger together than we are apart. You guys want to rest here? have to say an incantation before you cast an art? Yeah. They don't really add any extra power or anything, but reciting them is what allows the astral energy to come together and flow through me. It takes time to complete, but they're what lets me use such strong magic in the first place. What happens if someone interrupts you while you're in the middle of chanting? Then I have to start over from the beginning. As soon as my concentration breaks, any astral energy I've accumulated disperses. Got it. So once you start reciting, that's our cue to make sure that no enemies can get near enough to disrupt you. Yeah, that would be appreciated. Although, I do have one fun trick up my sleeve. Once I finish chanting a full incantation, I can hold on to a single astral art without casting it right away. So once the astral energy's in place, you can choose to set it off whenever you want? That's amazing! Yeah! I don't fully have the hang of it just yet, but I'm sure it'll come in handy sooner or later. I won't forgive you! Now or never! Deny! Keep that! I'm ready! My astral energy is in the wind! Bind. It's a duel of the arts! Let's get you off that way! Here's a healing art! Find free! Just work if they just are still! Can you take care of them? No sooner said than done! Now! Demons descend! Flashing back! An astral art? That's Demon my key! Watch this! Shut him down! Strike! Fall away! Carve through one! The astral energy is surging around me! How do you even know about all that astrally stuff? Same way I know what you do in the middle of the night. What? Are you serious? And thus our strength yet grows. Charging up! 
That's what my shield's for. Get behind me. Guys, I'll leave it to you. Rising warrior! I'm ready. Rising fire! Take this! Blue escape! Rising warrior! Rising Wyvern! 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 Rising Pieces! Attack time! Oh, if it's in the sky, it's mine! Oh, I never miss! Eat this! Do it! I'm I'm fire. Fire. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! That's some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. for the ages. Looks like it could be worth something. to me. I wonder what we'll find out there this time. Most likely Zoogles, I would reckon. I mean, other than them. No backing down! You're mine! Take this! Burn it! 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 Burn it!
Okay, here Whoa, I go. Hey, one at a time. You're mine. There we go. go. Come on, the hand. Oh, 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 no. Leave the insanity to me. Yeah, in a bind. to me. Here I come. That equipment should come in handy. longer will our healing arts last?
Maybe it's time I try on something new. sense any more enemies. <sighs> this place is rather gloomy. Why don't you lighten the mood for us while we're here then? <laughs> I'll see what I can do.
There's no point in reading it unless you plan on making it. We should think about eating soon. Really? I'm not all that hungry myself. Don't make me say it again. Uh, yeah, good idea.
What's this thing? You can tell it's tough just looking at it. Yeah, it'd probably mess us up good. Celebratory drink. What's this thing? Eat 
sure they're not playing around. Where are you going? Dance in the wind! The pig now. Take it. Get on in there. We'll be getting started. Crossblade! Talent score! It's gonna attack! Right, watch out! Be careful! No. Oh, you're the here. Here. here I go. You're mine. Eagle Frost. Why do you require a hand? Mega Ray. No further. Enjoy the ground while you're down. Annihilation. Mega Ray. I can handle it. Do not. Guess what the cuts are. I'm just getting started. I'm only getting started. Eliminate the dark. Come forth. Holy Land. I'm only getting started. Back into the fray. Now you see what I can do. Mega Ray. Dance in the wind. Air thrust. In a vine? Annihilate! Hey, drink it! Oh, yeah, no, here you comes know. something big! Try to die! Can't move! Fred! Ha ha ha! Sleep now! Let's get you all tucked away! Lightning condemned! Thunder blade! Got him on the run. Don't get cocky. Right. Still anyone's fight. This should do it. right. We should fall back to regroup and try again later.
hey. Yes! Hmm. Maybe. Hmm. I guess. <sighs> hey. <sighs> That's unfortunate. Okay, off we go. I always hear you muttering to yourself whenever we're in battle. So, uh, just what are you saying? Why do you want to know? Does it bother you or something? Not really. It's just the way you talk is sometimes kind of creepy. So I was wondering if you vent your frustration through your magic. Are you yelling, you stupid jerk, or something like that to pump yourself up? What? No, that's not what's happening during my incantations. I'm just focused, so I match my tone to fit the mood of whatever I'm trying to invoke. Invoke? Uh, how do I put it? Basically, the elemental astral energy behind each art, I guess. Astral energy? Hold on, are you saying you can talk to astral energy? Uh, not exactly. But if I put emotion into what I say, it's easier for me to properly cast my arts. That makes sense? Kind of. Okay, so if you can talk to astral energy, then you can ask it to, like, predict the weather or find secret treasure? Wait, you don't really think that, do you? Or you can ask it to send down lightning to where there's bad guys lurking and... May lightning condemn those who bear fall! Thunder Blade! Ah, what are you doing? You almost fried me with that! I just asked the astral energy to send down lightning where there were annoying boys. Tell me, Dohalim, has that skill of yours got a name? And what skill would this be, pray tell? You know, when you're talking to people around town, the way they suddenly become putty in your hands. I'm afraid I don't quite follow. I do. It's called friendly intimidation. Look imposing and speak in a deep, booming voice, and presto, you'll have people wrapped around your finger in no time. I would never stoop to such scandalous tricks. Any feelings of intimidation are solely in the eye of the beholder. So there is a knack to it! How do you learn it? Can anyone do it? Now you've got me curious. Is there special training to master? Hmm, let's see. An obsession with being elegant is a must. Oh, and it helps to be old-fashioned, too. Bonus points if you speak in a way no one can understand. If you've a bone to pick with me, it'd be quicker to just come out and say it. What? They look up to you, that's all. I'm just helping them along. Hey! What's got into Alvin and Law all of a sudden? I can barely understand a word they're saying. And what's with the weird poses? Was it something they ate? I hope you're willing to take the blame for this one. I wasn't expecting them to take me so seriously. I'll go and have a word with them. What do you all say to taking the path less trodden for once? Path? I don't see any path. Do you mean that thing that looks like an animal trail? Path may be a generous term. I'm assuming you know where it leads? Hmm. My gut says to a bridge. Oh, oh. Hoodle says your gut's wrong. Really? Well, it is definitely in the right general direction. Not that main roads are necessarily danger-free, but he does have an uncanny knack for insisting on some strange and unique routes. Alvin always did like a challenge. Can't say I appreciate some of the more daredevil ways he's taken us, though. Like the landslide he insisted was a shortcut before disappearing off the edge? Nearly gave me a heart attack. I'll say, yet the intrepid explorer looked as happy as a pig in muck. Probably best we stick to doing our own orienteering in the future. Hey, so what about this route then? Maybe if we pretend we can't hear him. 
Don't you think the path forward is fraught enough without making extra problems for ourselves? Maybe best to reel it back. Good point. I say we stick to the main track like regular travelers for once. Uh, guys? <sighs> I will break down this wall! <sighs> You can never be too prepared, but did we have to spend so much? My body seems to be doing okay. Thanks for waiting. Eat as much as you like.
Time to work off that last meal. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. All we have to do is get rid of that thing, right? off the bad guys from far off. It is. I mean, aside from adjusting for movement, wind speed, trajectory... <laughs> See? Easy. Way stronger. Yeah, nothing motivates you like having stakes this high. Looks like trouble with a capital T. Together, we got this. Reload. No escape. Not I today. Know. I can carve through each of their weak spots. In a bind, take this! Dragon 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 you picked the wrong fight! Take it! It's over! Annihilation! Now it's 
Can't get out of it's pinned down. Not bad. Demon descent. Blessing back. Is there no end to them? We're making some progress. Keep up the pressure. Amazing. Thanks, Trio. Be careful not to overdo it. I'm sorry. I'll do better. Go! 
Leaving the set! Flashing bang! They're putting up a fight! Let's pay them back for each strike! Light acid illuminate confiscated! Light acid hard below! The enemy is going all out! Stay away from my friends! It's about to strike! Look sharp, everyone! So much for this being a walk in the park. Don't let it get to you. We're a team out here. Each now we're them. Where are you going? I'm just getting started. In a bind? Nothing! Denied! It's weakened! This ends now! Get out of here with I'm just getting started. Sword Alpha! Sword Alpha! Sword Alpha! Just great. Hmm. Yes! I'm glad to hear it. <sighs> yes. Yes! <sighs> What? <laughs> Shh. 
Sure. Great. What are you fighting for? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's no way. What could a Danon like you possibly gain from helping a Renan like me? You really can't feel pain? It's just another thing I don't have. I don't remember anything about my past. A man numb to pain, and a woman whose very touch deals nothing but. You're wrong. You think this curse is some kind of great ability? Ball's in your court, soldier. What do you say? I want to fight. To live and taste freedom! Let us finish this. We've got a better chance working together. It's only over when you give up. You can trust me, you know? Maybe even lean on me. Until the day I died, I knew I would be alone. Now? I wish we had never met! I have everyone to thank for that, including especially you, Alvin. Do you... do you think I'm even worthy to? Bureau agents, the Snake Eyes must be here. The difference is, in Cislodia, it's not just Renans. They've got Danans spying on each other, too. The realm of Cislodia doesn't tolerate civil dissidents like you. I hereby detain you in the name of his lordship! No! He's joined by his fellow conspirators, the likes of Traitor and the Danan Witch. Except I've never heard of a Danan who can cast Astral Arts. Renan's eyes light up when they use Astral Arts. I guess that means you can't be a so-called bright eyes after all. Shut up! This is the only thing that's keeping me going anymore! Stay out of my way or I'll kill you! You never change, do you? You've always got that damn knowing look on your face! Move aside. I've heard enough! Shut your stupid mouth and die! So what do we do now? Count me in. Harmony and coexistence between the Renans and the Danans. Under him, for the first time in our lives, we Danans were treated with the respect we deserve. I'm Captain Kisara of the Elder Menencia Guard. There is no greater honor than being chosen to serve His Excellency. Thank you, Kisara. I'm Dohilim Ilkaris. But I have to know. How do you keep going with all you've been through? I assure you they are fairly compensated for their efforts. The fostering of a mutual respect among the classes. This I can change. However, for you it may be a simple request, but that can quickly become another's difficult burden. Have you come across even one slave being abused? Soldiers killing for sport? Suffering of any form? I would hazard that you have not. All I care for is maintaining peace. If so, then why did you betray him? You're saying it was all just a self-obsessed lie? Forgive me.